Friday, the 19th of September, 2014. I have somewhat of a confession to make. That was the last time that I ever picked up a pencil and a piece of paper and did any artwork. This was the last drawing that I ever did. And to compare that against this tattoo of a skull, this is the most recent skull that I have done. So what is the point of this video? Well, do you need to carry on drawing or practicing your art to progress your artistic ability to become a better tattoo artist. Now, I am seriously not joking. 2014 was the last time that I ever held a pencil in my hand to do any artwork. I have not painted, I have not drew, I have not done anything artistic apart from tattoo. So that begs the question, when you become a tattoo artist and you start to get very, very busy, you surround yourself with everything tattoo and everything else doesn't matter at all. It, re it really doesn't. Well, it didn't to me anyway. Tattooing was the only thing that I wanted to do and tattooing was the only thing that I wanted to get good at and progress. Now I had practiced my art on paper to get to a point where I could tattoo, but do I wish that I had continued to carry on drawing and do I think that that would have progressed my tattooing? So I wanted to just jump on the camera and quickly try and explain this thought that I've got going through my head. Do I wish that I continued drawing? Sometimes, sometimes, yes I do. However, I was so consumed with work and progressing in tattooing and that form of art that I didn't care to draw. And I wanted all my focus to be on just one thing, tattooing. I figured that if my focus was on drawing and tattooing, then I couldn't put 110% into tattooing. So a part of me does regret it, but a part of me doesn't regret it. Now, what I also didn't want to do was learn techniques or learn specific techniques to do something on paper or painting or any other medium apart from tattooing that couldn't be done while tattooing. So for example, you know, you will get a artist that does really nice, super detailed, hyper-realistic portraits and they will use graphite powder and they will use a scalpel, all right? And they will scalpel in like strands of hair or they will, you know, erase highlights and skin pores and stuff. And those are techniques that can't be used on skin. So I didn't want to become a better artist on paper. I wanted to be a better artist on skin. Now I hope this is like somewhat making sense. A lot of artists tend to think that progressing on paper progresses you on skin and to a certain extent it definitely does i mean you can practice composition you can practice you know proportions you can practice you know getting your values your your tonal values you can practice blends and stuff but but i honestly feel that tattooing is an extension of your artistic ability it's just like going into a new medium like painting or like graffiti or you know any medium that you can think of that you've not done before that you need to practice when you start off it doesn't matter how good of an artist you are when you start something new you are going to be terrible because you don't know the correct techniques to achieve what you want to achieve and this is the very sole reason that I did not continue any art apart from tattooing. Everything went into tattooing. But I just wanted to put out this quick video to let you know that I am living proof 
that you do not need to continue your artwork on paper if you don't want to. I don't feel like it's gonna hinder your progress as a tattoo artist. Now, if you cannot do something on paper, then you will not be able to do it on skin. So if you are worried about a tattoo, like do 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 it on paper first. Try drawing it and see how it and see how you fare. So drawing can be useful and it does have a place. I feel like oil painting and acrylic painting does translate to tattooing a little bit more when it comes to like skin tone and color theory and stuff. But you let me know. Have you continued? And I will see you all in the next video. If you are new around here, do not forget to subscribe, turn on the bell, do not forget to like this video, and I will see you all in the next one. Peace out, much as love.